This is the Western Digital 3 terabyte hard drive that I'm gonna install in my Mac Pro and I'm gonna show you how to do it. I'm not gonna do an unboxing because all hard drives are the exact same. So this is how to install it and set it up. Obviously first you wanna shut off your computer. Once you have it shut off, you can proceed to slide it out. I would recommend removing the power cable from your Mac Pro just in case. Flip the switch back here. That slides out. So I have these bays labeled. This is the main bay that comes with the machine. This is the second terabyte bay that I've added. The third terabyte, two terabyte bay. And this is the last bay. And you just slide it out. And that's what it looks like. And then you mount your hard drive after you've opened it up. Then you take your hard drive, turn it upside down, and there are four notches on there that line up. Tighten this down. This is what it'll look like. Yay. And you just uh, slide it back in. And that is how you install your three terabyte drive into your Mac Pro. We will put the case back together, plug in the power, and turn it on to make sure that it worked properly. And then I'll show you the steps after that on how to format it and such. So you'll get this error that says the disk you inserted could not be readable by this computer. Uh, and you can go to ignore. And then what you'll do as you'll type in disk utility then you click on the uh, three terabyte western digital drive you go to partition I do one partition and then uh, you can name it whatever you want to name it It'll automatically default, at least it did on this one, to Mac OS X Extended Journaled. Click Apply. Click Partition. And it will go through the process. And there is your three terabyte hard drive. And you can hit Command I to bring up the information and you have 2.9 terabytes of space available on it. And that is how you install and set up a hard drive in your Mac Pro. Thanks for watching, yay! Subscribe, deuces.